Hi, my name is Emma P. I'm your expert in getting shit done, best-selling author, coach, and mum. Welcome to video four. Today we're going to talk about your beliefs and identity. Okay, this one is a very interesting topic, your beliefs, because they are formed from when you are zero. From zero to seven years old, and I say seven, but it could be five, six, seven, you basically believe everything, don't you? Anything an adult tells you, you believe. And that's just kind of the way it is. Remember thinking about Santa Claus and the Easter Bunny? You remember everything and really believe everything that you're told, see, or feel, right? So everything around you, and just think about the people that you grew up with. What were they telling you and what did you believe in? Now from about seven to 14, you search for evidence to support the belief that you decided to believe in from zero to seven. I hope that makes sense. So you look for things that you want to support that evidence with. So coming back to the Easter Bunny, uh, you perhaps were looking for clues that the Easter Bunny was around. Now obviously there are some things that you don't believe in, but during this seven to 14 year period, you are actually working out what you believe in to form these these beliefs when you are a little one. And remember, you actually form beliefs throughout your entire life, but those really core beliefs at the very, very early stages of life. Then from about 14 to 21, you form an identity based upon the evidence that you were looking for to support the beliefs from zero to seven. So three main areas of your life that you form these beliefs. Now, as I've said, you will form beliefs every single day but it's actually what you look evidence for because our brains actually want to be right. So this is how your beliefs are formed. It's pretty interesting, hey? So check out video five because we talk about more detail how your brain filters these beliefs and how we actually get on in adult life. It is your time, it is your life. If you need that extra hand, please feel free to personal message me on Facebook. You will get a reply directly from me and we can have a chat on there as well.